All right, what's up guys? Welcome back. Today I got home to a package from brilliantpuzzles.com. A couple new products from them, uh, starting with the secret book, which is not a puzzle box, but it's something I really wanted to kind of show off because it's really, really well done, really well made. Uh, handcrafted secret compartment box made out of seasoned linen wood from the Tatra Mountain region of Poland. Um, again, all handcrafted very very nice uh, in order to get into this just slide the spine up and pull out the bottom and as you can see you got lots of space there to hide whatever it is you want to hide uh, if you want to pick one of these up for yourself i will definitely put the link in the description and uh yeah grab it for yourself grab it as a gift really really nice really well done now before we get into the brain teaser where I will attempt to solve this and if I don't as always I got my trusty solution hammer um, yeah if you want to give that subscribe button a push and follow what we're doing here that'd be great uh, and if you like what you saw at the end of it give it a thumbs up so without any further ado let's uh, try and figure this guy out um, so we have a key this is called the lock puzzle um, and obviously just like the last time, I think putting the key in the hole and turning would just be too simple. So we're probably just going to dispose of that. And uh, we got these knobs here that turn. But don't unscrew. No, they're glued on there pretty good. So this moves a little bit. And we got a keyhole. So I'm just going to grab a light in here. So if we take a look on the inside of this, I don't know if you can see that, but um, we can see that there is a piece of wood in there stuck. It's probably attached all the way through, which is probably our lock. And if we were to move the knob, I have a theory that if I'm right, I know how to figure it out. It's just going to be a pain in the ass trying to figure out. Yeah, so if we turn the knob, <clears throat> there's notches cut out of the inside of that so what we're gonna have to do to get this guy open is literally turn these guys make sure we figure out where the notch is in the right direction and this should slide out okay well we know what we got to do now it's just a matter of figuring it out great so if we get in there turn this guy around all right so the notch is right there So that's sad. I think if we keep this in this direction, should be able to pull it out. Now it's just a matter of figuring out how these ones move. It's in there pretty good. Come on. I wonder if I try to turn and pull at the same time, if it's going to give me, if I can feel where it is. Oh, hello. Okay, I think we got one of them in the right place. Yeah, you know what? If I pull on this while I'm turning it, I can kind of feel where it's getting stuck. So I think it's just a matter now of... Feels like the middle one there's caught. So move that back down a little bit. Come on. Where are you stuck? Yeah, like I can feel the inside of this one. Ah. 
cramping my fingers up pretty good though. Oh. Yeah, I can feel. Come on. Ah. There's resistance like from there to there. So where are you stuck? What if I turn this one the other way? No, oh, that locks it back up. So I had that right. Okay. Oh. Ah, man, my hand is cramping up. Hey, hey, we got it. All right. Well, that was uh, interesting. As you can see, you can see where the notches are and where it locks up. That was pretty cool. See how it opens up. All right. Well, let's put this back together and uh, we'll call it a day. Well done. That was pretty cool. I like that one. That was different. It's challenging. So the key obviously does nothing. And uh, we didn't have to use the solution. So uh, until next time, guys, thanks so much for watching. And uh, again, if you like what you saw with this guy, um, I'll put the description below if you want to pick one up for yourself or grab it as a gift. That'll be there for you as well. Until next guy time, guys. Cheers. Thanks.